Rutherford County Schools is starting their rezoning meetings. They have two more this week. Some of their schools are filling up. More people are moving to the county and the district says within five years they'll have 10,000 more students, so they have to rearrange. Our Danielle Jackson just came from one of those meetings. Some Rutherford County parents got the chance to look at two possible rezoning maps. They gave their input on why or why not they support the proposals. We are in this neighborhood here and we've been going to Rock Springs, so there's just great little sidewalks. Christina Tragley looks at the maps that could change where her daughter goes to school in the future. Right now where we're looking at on the rezoning, we would not be able to walk to school anymore. And it's not something we do every day, but the buses are super convenient. And when we have to drive her, it's right on the way and she can always walk. Rutherford County School District held one of the three public hearing meetings at Laverne High School where parents heard about the rezoning proposal. The school district says the student population has grown tremendously over a short time and they don't believe their current facilities will support future growth. But some parents like Christina believes there's a bigger issue that needs to be resolved. I'm thinking in terms of like where they've allowed houses to be built and where they're building utilities and let's let's think about where schools are when we're making those decisions. But some of that happens at the city level and the schools are at the county level and that leaves the parents kind of squeezed in the middle. The school Sharonda Martin Chow attends isn't impacted in any of the concepts presented. She supports the idea of the school district looking towards the future. I'm glad that Rutherford County School is taking a proactive approach and thinking about the populations um, in the schools and educating our students. Schools at this point are extremely full and classroom sizes are probably at capacities of 30, 35 and you have one teacher. Rutherford County School District plans to have two more rezoning meetings. Parents can give their input Tuesday, September 19th at Stewart Creeks High School and Wednesday at Siegel High School. Both meetings will start at 6.30 p.m. In Rutherford County, I'm Danielle Jackson for WSMV4.